What's going on everybody? Mandalorian Historian here and today I am bringing you the latest gameplay leaks from Helldivers 2. So if you're looking for the latest ways you're going to be able to spread some managed democracy, be sure to strap on in and let's drop into the news. Alright, so up first we have the brand new MG206 machine gun, and this thing looks absolutely amazing. I'm a big fan of the machine guns, but sometimes it just feels like they don't have enough power. This looks like it has three different fire modes, that way you can control the speed that it fires, and then on top of that, it looks like it throws out some damage. Here we see them going against a charger, and if you don't know, this is the current meta. You throw your stun grenade, it allows you to get in behind and to just really drill in on them. And as you can see here, this is just doing some absolute work. Now this is a heavy machine gun I think it says it has medium damage and then a very high ammo capacity so I think the current machine guns we have now will be better for like ad clears and then this will be better for heavier targets I'm very interested to see how this thing actually does against the flying bugs because right now they're a huge pain we do actually see some gameplay of him actually fighting the shriekers and it just it, it absolutely lays these things out like I don't think I know anything that just drops them this quickly quickly in the game so I might definitely be running this and then up next we have something that I have been waiting for ever since it was leaked and that is the emancipator mech because I absolutely love the mechs a lot of people sleep on them but I think the current mech we have is an absolute savage at dealing with the bugs and this looks like it's going to be its more beefier cousin I mean it basically starts off with what looks to be four auto cannons two on each arm however if you actually look at the auto cannons compared to the size of the hell diver you will realize that these are way bigger than your typical auto cannons and if that is the case that means along with the 75 rounds you get in each arm you're going to have more than enough damage to put down any threat you encounter during your matches and i think what this mech is intended to be is basically be a counter to the automatons because like i said right now the mech we got is good outside of blowing itself up every once in a while against the bugs it absolutely wrecks them but they fall short against the automatons and i think that's what this mech is going to fix and last but not least, we have the crossbow, and I have been watching a lot of The Walking Dead, so I have been wanting to become a Daryl Dixon in the Helldiver universe for a while now, and at first, as soon as this was announced, I was on board. But after seeing the gameplay footage here, I'm not exactly sure, because while this is a supposed to do explosive damage, it is one shot, and it looks like it shoots pretty slow. And then on top of that, this is only difficulty 4, so we don't have the gro tight groupings of normal enemies that we'll see on the higher difficulty levels. But so far, it doesn't look like the explosive damage is enough to really make this as something that I would use as my primary. And then just as a quick bonus, they actually discovered some new planets in the game, and this one is actually an acid primordial planet, which more than likely means that instead of dealing with firestorms, we're going to be dealing with acid storms, and that could get really nasty. And one thing I think we might see with all the mutations going on with the bugs is different types of bugs and different types of attacks. What if the bugs actually start adapting to the planets and start getting attacks based on those planets? I don't know. It's just something I think might be coming and might be interesting. But that's it for all the latest leaks, but I gotta know, what are you looking forward to the most? Leave a comment, and if you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that like button. Until next time, remember, everybody fights and nobody quits.